Hello there. Today I bring to you a beautiful game between George Koltanowski and Marcel de Fosse. Take a look at this position. Here, after bishop to d6, if you were Koltanowski, what would you play? So white to play and win from here. So this is probably a good position to pause your video and work it out. Okay, so let me start this video with this beautiful idea uh, that arises from this position. So this involves a double bishop sacrifice. So we first start with a Greek gift. Bishop takes h7 check. Black has to take it. And after black takes, uh, king takes h7. So we have queen to h5 check. King goes to g8. And now comes another beautiful move. The second bishop sack. Bishop takes g7 opening up the king. King takes g7. Now queen to g5 check. King doesn't have many places to move. So king h7. And this is a good time to do a rook lift. Rook to d4. Black doesn't have much defense here. So it tries uh, bishop to h2 check after our king moves to h1. Um, black doesn't have much to do. So de Fosse tries uh, queen h4, just sacrificing his queen. Uh, rook takes f4 and bishop takes f4. Queen takes f4. And now we have our second rook lift. Uh, just ready to rock the uh, black's position open. So now we have rook e5 and at this position, Marcel de Fosse resigned. Isn't that beautiful? So let me show you this end game once again and then I'll show you how this position arose and uh, the beautiful calling opening which uh, leads us to uh, this ending. So let's uh, go back. Alright, so this was the position. Greek gift. Bishop takes h7 check. King takes h7. Queen h5 check. King to g8. Bishop takes g7. King takes g7. Queen to g5 check. King h7. Rook to d4. Bishop to h2 check. King h1. Queen f4. Rook takes f4. Bishop takes f4. Queen takes f4. Rook g8 and rook to e5, Marcel de Fosse resigns. Isn't that lovely? Now, these kind of positions are awesome to study. But the point is, if you stick to one opening, then you start uh, landing into some familiar positions again and again. And when you, uh, when positions become familiar to you, that's when you start to study them. And, uh, and and then you see these kind of brilliances. Okay, so what happened in the game actually? So let me take you through the entire game and explain how this position came on the board. So this is a Cole system game between Georges Koltanowski and Marcel de Fosse, uh, starting with d4, knight f6, knight f3, d5, e3, e6, bishop to d3, c5, c3, knight c6, knight bd2, bishop to d6. Short castle, short castle. Okay, so this is the famous and my favorite uh, Cole opening, the Cole system traditional line. In this position, uh, Koltanowski chooses d cross c5 
Now, this is a very interesting continuation. And at this position, uh, both uh, uh, Koltanowski and Defossi, both black and white, um, are pretty much equal as per the computer evaluation. So Bishop takes c5, and now we have e4. The e4 is a thematic uh, move in the Cole opening, and you will see this setup with e4 at the right time happening again and again. It's a very easy system to uh, master that way. Um, usually the junior players would uh, exchange pieces, giving an awesome uh, position for white. So uh, if there are a couple of exchanges, uh, we have a very good position on the board to play for. But let's see what happened in the game. So queen to c7, which is a seemingly okay move. We have queen e2, uh, bishop to d6. Now, this is where uh, computer starts shouting that, uh, um, that white may be having an advantage. Okay. So, we continue with our preparation uh, to fork uh, with e5, uh, knight to g4, avoiding the fork and at the same time uh, uh, entering into the white's territory for an attack. So, look at the bishop, the knight, and the queen eyeing at the h2 square. So, looks dangerous, but nothing to worry. We have everything covered. So, h3, knight goes back. Now, this a seemingly ugly position uh, for the knight uh, at e5 um, is probably the start of an impending disaster. So knight takes e5, knight takes e5, e takes d5, e takes d5, knight f3, knight takes f3 check, queen takes f3, bishop to e3, we develop our bishop to e3, bishop to e6, I'm sorry, and then bishop to e3, and rook a d8. So the plan for us is to go here and then have the nice diagonals uh, on our control. So first bishop c2, uh, then b5, bishop to d4. So we have achieved our dream position, right? So Koltanowski has a dream position on the board and he is ready to attack. Well, Marcel de Fosse senses some trouble and wants to exchange the bishops. But why would we do that? Um, rook a to d1. If there is an exchange, then we have the rook uh, coming, sorry, not here, but to here. Uh, to h4 so, so that would be our plan uh, and then we'll have uh, attack on h7 okay b4 we don't care what happens on that side bishop to e5 attacking the queen bishop to d6 and this is the position which is worth studying so if you have this board do you remember how to win from here? Bishop takes h7, check, that's the Greek game. King takes h7, queen to h5, check, king g8, b, bishop takes g7, king takes g7, queen to g5, check, king h7, rook d4, bishop h2, check. From here, it's just, uh, black is just desperate uh, to delay uh, the disaster. Uh, king to h1, queen f4, rook takes f4, bishop takes f4, queen takes f4, rook g8, rook e5, and the game is over. Isn't that beautiful? Just for your benefit, I'll walk over the game once again from the beginning. So it starts with d4, and we reach uh, the Kole uh, opening somewhere around here. Yes, here. So we reach the Kole opening uh, here. So see the 
nice uh, uh, I'm sorry so that's not what I wanted to do so we have a nice pawn triangle setup and our queen would like to come here rook comes here and then we want to push uh, e4 so this is the idea behind the Cole system so we have the Cole opening and uh, this is the first moment uh, to know and here uh, we go uh, pawn takes uh, c5 okay so let's start from the beginning d4 knight f6 knight f3 d5 e3 e6 bishop to d3 c5 c3 knight c6 knight bd2 bd6 short castle short castle uh, and we have uh, the Cole system almost in place so here e takes c5 is the move to remember bishop takes c5 the Cole's thematic pawn push e4 queen c7 queen e2 bishop d6 rook e1 knight d4 h3 knight g5 knight takes e5 knight takes e5 e takes d5 e takes d5 knight f3 knight f3 check knight takes f3 check but the queen takes f3 bishop to e6 bishop to e3 rook a d8 bishop to c2 b5 bishop to d4 b c5 rook a d1 b4 bishop to e5 bishop to d6 and thus we reach the position that we studied from here a double bishop sacrifice wins the game bishop takes h7 check king takes h7 queen h5 check king g8 bishop takes g7 king takes g7 queen g5 check king h7 rook d4 bishop h2 check king h1 queen f4 rook takes f4 bishop takes f4 queen takes f4 rook g8 and rook e5 uh, this is going to just finish the game um, uh, very easily for white hope you enjoyed the game uh, i look forward to bring you more such brilliant games with the Kohle system thank you